Are you feeling lonely online? No, 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 not that way. I mean, are people not finding you online? Because today in the Marketing Tune-Up, we're gonna help you learn how to use search engine optimization to bring people to your site. Now stop me if you've heard this. Dear Madam or Sir, your website is not ranking well for the following terms. Please let us know if we can help. It seems that every week I get an email from someone telling me my website doesn't rank well. And to most of us, it's a mystery. How do you show up on Google? How do you get found? I'm here to tell you a simple truth. It's not a mystery. It's very easy. Unfortunately, it's kind of hard. The short answer is be amazing. Do good work. And beyond that, I'll tell you exactly how you can improve your visibility online. So visibility online, when we talk about that, that means that when people search a word in Google, like maybe used Fords, your website shows up on the top of the page. We know that 80% of people only look at the first page of Google, and so you need to get onto that page. The process of increasing that visibility is called search engine optimization. A search engine is like Google or Bing. Optimization means you're creating content that is most optimized for that search engine. Lots of times you hear it referred to as SEO. But it's not a mysterious thing. You can actually improve your SEO with three simple steps. Through links, authority, and social. That's right, social. This is a brand new addition to the SEO world. But let's first talk about links. Google decides that you should be on top of the page if people have given you a vote or a thumbs up. So if your local newspaper links to your website, that's a thumbs up from the newspaper. But not all votes are created equal. If the New York Times links to your website, that's gonna be 10 times greater than the link from your local newspaper. So as a website, we want people to link to us and ideally influential, well-trafficked websites to link to us. The more links we get, the better we are in search. The other thing that we can do to improve links is to connect to people. Tell them about what we're talking about. If you have an event for maybe uh, local race drivers and you have a sports car, tell their organization. They might link to you in social media or from their own websites and blogs. That'll help you be found online. The second step is through authority. Google looks at what's on your page and decides, are you relevant for what that person is searching for? So there's a couple of ways that you can increase your authority or relevancy for that search. Your page titles is the first one. You can change the page title for every single page. So whenever you create a new blog post or a new website page, on the very top you'll have a title and that's telling Google what the page is about. Another way that you can improve it is thinking about maybe eight or 10 words that you definitely want to rank for. Remember, it's best if these are non-branded words because people already can find you with your brand name. When we create our page title, we follow this formula. Just think about one keyword, maybe used cars, another keyword, maybe Ford, and then use our geography and our brand name. So we could say Sioux Falls, South Dakota, and the name of your dealership. That's a great way to do a page title. Now change that page title for each page and you'll have a large number of words that you're ranking for. Finally, one people don't think about very often is social. Google and Bing are actually changing the results of searches based on what your friends are searching for. So if I've connected to you and you're an auto dealer, I'm gonna find your results higher than your competition because we are connected on maybe Twitter or on Facebook or on some social network. And so with social, there's two things that we wanna do. We wanna first obviously connect and engage with people. The more people connected to us, the more our results are relevant to them. Finally, we wanna think about authorship. We can actually tell Google every time we're publishing content that it's Scott creating that content. So I start to build up authority as an author. And in the future, when I write about cars, I'm gonna be the first result. Now remember, when we talk about SEO, we're talking about Google and Bing, but Google gets almost 80% of searches in the US. And so we wanna make sure to look there first, optimize for Google, and make sure that people can find us so we're not feeling so lonely. In just two minutes a week, you can save time, save money, and sell more cars with the marketing tune-up. Subscribe on our website to get started today.